Hello, in this video we're going to have a look at constructing RHS triangles. So we've got a triangle, we've got a right angle in the corner, uh, we've got a base side which we know the length of, we've got the hypotenuse, the longest side which we also know the length of. Remember the hypotenuse is always going to be opposite the right angle here. Uh, the example that we're going to look at is this one here, we're going to have triangle ABC, the base length is 6 centimetres, hypotenuse opposite that right angle is 8 centimetres long. We're going to need a ruler and we're going to need a compass. Okay. Uh, I'm going to start off with the base line. So I have uh, a length of 6 centimetres, I'm going to draw that in, I've already marked A on my diagram, and I'm going to draw a length of 6 centimetres, and I'm going to mark that length, I'm going to mark that point B. Uh, I then need to construct a perpendicular line at the point A. So for this construction we've only got our compass and a ruler, we need to be able to construct a perpendicular at the point A. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to extend my line AB to the left. Uh, I'm then going to take my compass and I'm going to uh, measure a distance from the point A both to the left and to the right along that line. So I'm going to mark an arc to the left of point A, move my hand away you might be able to see it, and another point to the right hand side of A. I'm going to open my compass up a little bit so it's that far, just going to go a little bit further and I'm going to draw an arc from both of those points above and below the line AB. So I'm going to put my compass on the left hand point and draw an arc and I'm going to put an arc underneath the point A. And then without changing the width of my compass I'm going to put it on the right hand point and I'm going to mark two more arcs and they should cut through the arcs that I've already drawn on my paper. So there's the point above A and there's the point below A. Okay. If I connect those two points up now, it's two intersecting points, I should have a perpendicular that runs through the point A. So I know that my point C is going to be somewhere along that line. I know that it's eight centimetres away from B. So if I go back to my compass and I set it to eight centimetres, A little bit further. Okay, uh, I'm then going to put the compass on the point B and draw an arc. I'm now going to connect up and put the intersecting point with my point B. Mark this at point C. We know that the hypotenuse is 8 centimetres long. My base length is 6 centimetres. I have a right angle in my triangle and I've successfully drawn my RHS triangle. 